everyone. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Welcome to our EA Sports Showdown here tonight. The crowd is hopping for this one. We'll send it down to ice level. Ray Ferraro between the benches. What are you seeing for tonight, Ray? Well, I'm looking at a team, each team that's going to try and impose their will on the game. Play a fast game, play a physical game, try and take your game onto their doorstep. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. There's been a healthy buzz for this one. Now it's time to see if it lives up to the hype. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. Looking to set up offensively. Pokes it away in his own end. Scores! Tina! the two centers tie up. Here he is in front! Scores! Man, it can be deflating if your power play stinks. When your power play does score, everybody grabs a little bit of energy. If you're the goalie here, you just want to move as quick as you can. Maybe it'll hit you, but it's so close to the net that pass is on the tape and off the tape in a hurry. Play set to resume with the faceoff ready to go. Gives them nothing in front, and he elects to play the puck. Charlottetown's playing it through center. On the attack along the boards, he scores! They take the lead! Well, it looked like this game was going to be even for the longest time because nobody seemed to have the upper hand. Well, not quick enough or not in the right position. In any case, the goalie gets just a little piece of the shot, and it's in the net. Tenacity finally earns themselves a one-goal lead. Now be a little cocky. Play like a front runner. You've got the lead. You've worked hard for it. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Keeps control of the puck after taking a little knock. Here's a short pass to Payne. To the low slot. Blocked in front. Answered the call on that play. Again, the scores! Well, I think we might be in for an anything you can do. I can do better sort of night. Yeah, this is starting to look like a game that can stretch out and end up in overtime. These teams are evenly matched. Really nice play. Quick pass on the tape and into the net. So quickly, the goalie can't get closed up and make the save. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. We got a tie game. James moves it into the attacking end. And that's broken up with a stick in front. And he makes the save. Halifax gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. And makes the save. No, he, he scores. He thought he had it, but it must have gone off him. It's in the net. And that's a goal. I always have zero sympathy for the goalie. That's a tough break, bad break for him, you bet. But the puck goes into the net after somehow it's funneled that way and it bounces around into the cage.
Towns gotta be looking at the clock here now, Ray. This is when the clock goes really slowly. You want it to run fast, and it's just meandering its way to the finish. Now he tries to get it across to Cruz. Oh, he comes up with a stop as he got the glove on it. He scores! Could we get OT here? Well, we got a better chance now, don't we? The game's tied up late here in the third period. The coach was pushing his players to stay aggressive, and they get the equalizer. This makes the coaches look smart every time. They depend on him for offense, and he delivers James time and time again. The Highlanders have essentially said to everybody, buckle up as they have evened things up. Less than a minute to go now here in regulation. Comes up on the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Overtime, let's go. All right, get your sudden death OT pools going. Get your social media predictions. Overtime is underway, people. Denies that opportunity. But he came out, and they score! That's the game! The Whalers are feeling much better about themselves as they deliver an OT. I thought they were starting to wear down, James, but they get the winner, and it's their points in the back pocket. Manny laid a beauty of a pass across there. Enough air to clear the sticks, and it lands perfectly on the shooter's stick. Well, the post-game salute to the fans. Do you like this? In my day, it would have felt awkward. Yeah. Now it just feels like part of it, like the way it should be. Hooray, Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.